Hey guys, it's me, Poppy Rain here today. I'm going to be showing you my new caboodle that Daddy bought me. And my organization of it. And everything in it. And I'll do a crossplay review. So this is my new caboodle. It's freaking huge. It has hinges on both sides. It's a con app. You can see the label on there, Con Air Pro. It opens from here. And if you can see those holes in there, those are locks. Because it locks up. So you open it like this. And then you just, you guys can't see that. It's not an actual caboodle caboodle. Because daddy didn't know what he was doing, but he said, oh, big and expensive. So he bought big and expensive. So it opens like that. I'm trying to find a better angle so you guys can see a little bit better. All right, there you go, you guys can see better. Okay, so it opens up like this. And then this pulls out, and it's got two drawers there, as you guys can see. And then it's got the one drawer here. And then it's got, can't see the bottom very well, but there's a, I can't really lift the tray up at the current moment, but there's a tray in the bottom. But we're going to do, so this is organization slash review. Because I have a couple things to add into here. on from another video uh, so hold on you guys cannot see all right so in this compartment right here we have blushes so we have this blush from where is this from from clinique this is actually really good this is one of my go-to blushes We have Better Home, your Beauty Benefits Hollywood. This one I like, it's way too dark for me. This, I don't know, I think it's from either Dollar General or Dollar Tree. Then we have Wet n Wild Color Icon. This is sparkly, this one works really, really well. Come on, you guys can't see. My sparkles, ah, there you go, you guys can see sparkles kind of. But it is super sparkly. I love it. Um, this one works really well. This is from Dollar Tree. So just an... Ow. FYI, guys. Most of the products you're going to see are cheaper products. So it'll give you some kind of review as to... Um, what cheaper products are good to use and what are not. We have... CoverGirl Cheekers. In the shade... Nouvelle... Tianti. Um, I have actually never used this one. This one's still sealed. That I think was might have been from Dollar General. We have another sparkly one. This is Color Mates. That one is either from Dollar General or Dollar Tree. Um, you, sorry, it, you guys can't see the spark. It's because it's dark and glary. You can't really see sparkles very well. But I don't know where this one came from. Um. Again, that one's never been used either, so I can't really <laughs> review those for you. Okay, this I is kind of dirty. This is my brush cleaner. I got oh, from the Dollar Tree. That works really well. I have yet to use these tweezers, but they were super cool. There. 
metallic, rainbow, as you guys can see, the Dollar Tree. That's, and then also in that compartment, we have two little pods of loose glitter. The loose glitter, I'm not super happy with. We have that color and that, the, oh, those are, I think, the same color. Yeah. I'm not super happy with those. Those are from Claire's. They don't work very well. I mean, I use them for my lips. They don't work super well. The little pods, though, are super cute. They work... super well they're from dollar tree in the next compartment over here we have more loose glitter we have that color that color and like a pinky color those are all from dollar tree or sorry the pods are from dollar tree the loose glitter is from claire's and again not super happy with the loose glitter. The pods are great. And the pods actually came with these too. Then I have an extra empty one. So that's that. Then on this side, you guys cannot see that. Holy poop. So then we have this side. So in this compartment right here, what are these? They're getting gross. Okay. We have my cream makeup. I can't remember. I think I might have got this from Spirit. Or was it Five Below? I don't remember. But this works really well. Um, the only problem, it, this is for costume makeup. The only problem with this is after a couple hours it starts to get cracky and blotchy so be very mindful of how long it's going to be because like we went to our little convention we entered the contest but we had to be there at like noon the contest i think was at like five by the time we got to the contest my makeup looked like crap so just be very cautious of of, like if you're doing a contest or anything how long you apply this before you do that mm, we have my la colors liquid eyeshadows in purple and pink both from the dollar tree these are like the two greatest eyeshadows on the planet they work super super well very pigmented we have my la color setting spray i think it makes it more runny than set it then we have a Wet n Wild multi stick in white and I kind of broke the black one, but in black. These again are super good. I got those for costume makeup. They work super well. Then in this compartment. Then in this compartment next to it, we have eyeshadows. Well, my smaller ones. We have LA Colors Little Pod. Highly, highly, highly recommend. This is from Dollar Tree. Oh, and we have my random body, wet and wild body glitter. This sucks. I mean, it kind of works, but not really. It's like a cream glitter. We have this, I don't even know, wet and wild glittery eyeshadow. It doesn't work very well. Don't recommend it. That was from Dollar Tree. We have another wet and wild one. Again, not very good. Don't recommend it. Doesn't work very well. From Dollar Tree. This one isn't terrible, but it's not great. This is LA Colors. Wasn't horrible, wasn't great either. I only tried the middle color there 
pink color. Yeah, that was from Dollar Tree. Then we have Better Homes, Better, or Beauty Better Cats. I don't know where this is from, but I have yet to try this one, so I can't review it anyways. We have this one from the Dollar Tree. Again, the LA colors, and it was so-so. And then we have this Mary Kay one. I mean, it's nice and all, even though it's, like, massively old. But I'm not, like, super in love with it, per se. I mean, quality-wise, it's great. Color-wise, eh. Not my favorite. Then in this compartment, we have brushes. We have these spongy brushes from Dollar Tree. They work pretty well and you can wash them. I don't know what that black stuff is, but we have this little fishy brush from Dollar Tree, which I use for putting you know, baby powder on my baby otter. We have another Dollar Tree brush that works pretty well. <coughs> this brush I've used the heck out of. It's a watery, glittery brush from Five Below. There's a set. Um, I like this one very well. I have yet to try these ones. This one I think I might have used once there's our the set oh here's the last one in the set that i have yet to use we have this little brush from five below i haven't used it yet so i couldn't tell you We have this set that I absolutely love. This brush, as you can see, I've used. These are from Five Below. They're really nice. Uh, we have one more. These are all sold individually, by the way, at the Dollar Tree. And then we have my Elf eyeshadow brush. I'm not a huge eyeshadow brush person. But I prefer the disposable ones, so we have that. But that one works really well if you're that type of person. Mm. Then in this bottom part. Down here, we have my big, this is all that glitters and gold, all that glitters palette from Five Below. I don't recommend Five Below makeup, at least eyeshadow anyway, sucks balls. That's from Five Below, that sucks. And this one, this Neon Brights palette from Five Below, this sucks too. So I don't recommend. Uh, and then we have this little one. This black LA Colors one from Dollar Tree. This one isn't terrible. Not my favorite, though, but not terrible. We have these little sponges that I use for doing costume makeup. These are great from Dollar Tree. Apparently, they're rewashable, which I didn't know. Then we'll, we'll take out this bottom tray. And we'll do this first compartment here. So, the newest things I got were these 
If you saw my recent haul, you would know. This is Salt Rain Chimelan Pink Salt Moisturizing Lip Balm Cherry and Shea Butter. These smell bad. I mean, they don't work too bad. They taste bad and they smell bad. So I have two of those. We have this one from the Dollar Tree. That I have not tried yet. This one from the Dollar Tree, which I have not tried yet. We have this one. From the Dollar Tree, this one smells really good. The little lips. I have not tried it, but it smells good. Then we have, let's see. I don't think I've tried this one yet. But these are the mood changing ones. I have two of these. This is the one I've tried. I don't hate them, don't love them. These are from Dollar Tree. We have this Fanta Lip Smacker. Don't remember where I got that one. This is really accurate. We have a visitor. We have a visitor. <coughs> Hi, is a baby. Hi. You gonna be a nice kitty now? What? There's no other kitties in here for you to play with. Sorry, my brother, my boyfriend's brother's cat came in here. We have this LA Color Lip Balm from Dollar Tree. I've not tried it, but I'm willing to say pretty much the same thing as this, just different flavor. That is going to be great. Because I have this one, too. Those work pretty well. And... Then I have this troll one that someone gave me as a thank you gift. And that works pretty well. Then I'm going to lip glosses. Yeah, a few random lipsticks in this compartment. You have this pouty pout lip gloss from Ellie Collars from Dollar Tree. Mm, it's not terrible, it's not great. It's middle of the road. We have this one. I don't remember where it came from. Again, it's middle of the road. It's Borgies. Be gloss up gloss. Uh -uh. We have this one, I think from Dollar Tree. Yeah, this is LA Color. No. Yeah, LA Color. It's just one socks balls. This is my favorite lip gloss on the planet. This is Liquid Cat Suit. I think this might have come from Family Dollar, Dollar General. Love it. Highly recommend if you're looking for a good blue color. These ones are Sinful Colors, Pout and Play. From Dollar Tree, they absolutely suck. Ow. I literally might have to take these shoes off. They're killing me, though. So. Like this. Then we have this LA Colors. It's not great, not terrible. Mm, 
and this is pure color. Uh, again, middle of the road. Not great, not terrible. Don't remember that one's from. Then we go into my lipstick. For lipstick, we have the Serpentine Metallic. Don't love it, don't hate it. This was from CVS. We have LA Color Shiny. I have not tried yet from Dollar Tree. Daddy bought that for me. We have this Lippy Duos lipstick and lip gloss from Dollar Tree. Um, the lip gloss sucks. The color lipstick is really good and stains your skin. I used it for costume. We have CoverGirl. This is, what color is this? Flushed. I don't think I've tried this one yet. This one was from CVS as well. Or was it Walgreens? I think, I don't know, CVS Walgreens. Uh, from a drugstore. Mm, we have this cream, cream lipstick. This is mood changing. Um, sorry, don't mind the cat. The cat's being an ass. Kitty shitty, stop. No one wants to see your butthole. Mm. I have no clue where this was from, but I don't recommend. Mm. We have another cream lipstick in blue. Again, don't know where that was from. I think Dollar Tree. But I highly disrecommend. Oh, we have this one that I hate. This is LA Colors. This one is horrible. From the Dollar Tree. Don't recommend. We have this Color Mates. I don't... I think that might have been from Dollar Tree. That one's not bad. Don't love it, don't hate it. Stop! Shitty Kitty. Getting into my shit. We have this. What is this? This lip liner that I have not tried, so I can't reveal. But that's from a Dollar Tree. Came with the lipstick Daddy bought me. What are you doing? Are you gonna pee on my shit? Oh, she's just freaking <sighs> being annoying. Yeah. Okay, this is my favorite lipstick on the planet. This is Pout It Out from Dollar Tree. My favorite blue, anyways. I, I highly recommend. Pout It Out lipstick is good, but their lip gloss sucks. We have this one that's forever old. And I'm surprised it still works. Don't remember my mom gave that to me. It's the middle of the road. Don't love it, don't hate it. Oh, this is my favorite lipstick on the freaking plant. This is Black Radiance. Um, I can't remember where I got this from. I want to say Dollar General, Family Dollar. Highly recommend. Black Radiance is good. We have this Elf Jumbo Lip Gloss Stick. Um, I do not... This was from Dollar Tree. Do not recommend. She's like purposely looking for my bin. What is your male function? Can I move you that way? And last but not least for lipsticks, we oh, have no. this sparkle, Stop. oh, it's color shine from Dollar Tree. Don't love it, don't hate it, I guess. Go over there. Then the last section we have is lip scrubs. And such. So we have this lip oil. I have not tried this one, but I have. This is LA Colors. Lip oil, but I have that one. I love these. These work great. Highly recommend. We have a LA Colors lip scrub. I have two of them. Again, 
They're middle of the road. Don't love them, don't hate them. And last but not least, we have this LA Colors Sugar Lip Scrub, and I couldn't tell you. I haven't used it yet. So yes, that is my makeup review slash what's in my makeup case slash organization video. All right. Hope you guys enjoy. And I will catch you in another video.